a very good evening to all the neat ug mbbs aspirants 2023 uh, this video is about new upcoming medical colleges in the year 2023-24 across india there are various new medical colleges coming up in india in 2023-24 uh, the number of seats being approved in these medical colleges we are going to give you the details as well as we are also going to provide you with the information in the seat increment that is new seats being added to existing medical colleges across india be it, be it government private and deemed uh, i hope you like this video and if you really like this information kindly share like and subscribe for our channel we'll be very glad to bring uh, up-to-date information every day or as it is happening uh, in the world of medical admissions across India. So without wasting any time, let's begin. So these are the new upcoming medical colleges. As you can see it on your screen, uh, we have uh, uh, made the list according to alphabetical orders of the state, starting with Andhra Pradesh right till West Bengal. So let's begin with uh, andhra pradesh we can see there are four government medical colleges coming up with a annual intake of 150 seats all the four government colleges have been approved with 150 seats so 600 government seats are being increased in the state of andhra pradesh assam we can see three medical colleges being coming up with 100 seats each being approved so 300 new seats in Assam also, all going to government medical colleges, all the three new government medical colleges. Gujarat has been uh, approved with 300 seats, but both are in private medical colleges named Ananya College of Medicine and Swami Narayan Institute of Medical Sciences. Haryana is the only state where deemed universities uh, have come up in the year in 2023. And both the deemed universities are constitute uh, institute uh, of their respective deemed universities. As we see, Maharishi Markandeshwar College of Medical Sciences Research, Sadobor. Uh, this is a constitute institute of uh, MMU so Ambala and uh, Amrita School, Kochi. Now has a campus in Amrita School of Medicine, Faridabad, Haryana, with an annual intake of 150 seats in Faridabad campus. So 300 seats in Haryana, both uh, the colleges are deemed, okay. Um, now 300 seats are approved in these uh, medical colleges. Jammu Kashmir, we see two new upcoming medical colleges. One is Udhampur, Udhampur and Handwara, both having uh, approval of 100 seats. Karnataka, we have a private uh, medical college, Sri Chamundeshwari Medical College and it has been approved with 150 seats now karnataka again has a private medical college coming up with 50 new seats it's sri madhusudan sai institute of medical sciences and research and it is a private institution madhya pradesh has a new government medical college at satna with 150 seats Maharashtra has one government medical college and two private uh, medical colleges. Government college having an approval of 100 seats and both the private medical colleges having an approval of 150 seats. Both are based out of Parbani and Amravati respectively. Nagaland again has a government college with 100 new seats being approved for Nagaland Institute of Medical Sciences and Research. Odisha also sees a new government medical college at Bhavani Patna with 100 new seats. Rajasthan, we see 400 seats are being approved uh, with four new medical colleges in Bundi, Alwar, Hanumangar and Karoli. Tamil Nadu also has two new private medical institutes with 150 seats each, Nanda Medical College and Dhanalakshmi Srinivasan Institute of Medical Sciences and Hospital. Moving ahead uh, with uh, another private new medical college coming up in Tamil Nadu. It is named as PSP Medical College uh, Hospital and Research Institute with 150 seats being approved. Now going up with Telangana, we can see the number of seats this year. There are seven new government medical colleges in Telangana and 
so 700 new government seats in seven new medical colleges and we have also four private medical colleges in telangana with 150 seats each so the number of seats this year telangana approximately is increasing by 1300 which is a very good news for telangana students and we see a new medical college coming up in up also which is named as sks hospital medical college and research center mathura with 150 seats so this was all about new medical colleges coming up for the year 2023 starting from andhra pradesh we saw uh, andhra pradesh has some seats um, the new medical college in Madhya Pradesh, we saw medical college in uh, Maharashtra, Telangana, Tamil Nadu, as well as Rajasthan having good number of seats. So this was the this was all about the new upcoming medical colleges. So let's see uh, how it has turned out. So Andhra Pradesh, we can see four government medical college, 150 seats each, 600 new government seats. Assam, we see three government medical colleges with 300 seats. Gujarat, we see two private medical college with 300 seats. Haryana, the only state with two new deemed university with 300 seats. Jammu Kashmir, two government medical colleges with 200 seats. Karnataka, we see only two private medical colleges with 200 seats. Uh, and we can see here that Madhya Pradesh again has a one government medical college with 150 seats. Uh, we see Maharashtra one government medical college and two private colleges with 300 number of total seats. And uh, uh, we can see here the total number of seats in Maharashtra has gone up to 400. I'm very sorry it is not 300 it is 400. Uh, in Karnataka, there are 200 seats, yes, and in Gujarat, 300 seats, government seats, okay. Uh, Nagaland has 100 new seats, Odisha as well as has 100 seats, Rajasthan 400 new seats, all in government medical colleges. Tamil Nadu, we see three private medical colleges with 450 seats. Telangana, we see seven new government colleges, four new private colleges with total number of 1300 seats. Uttar Pradesh, we see only one private medical college and which is uh, with 150 seats. So the total seats we can see in private have increased by 2000 and in government it has increased by 260, 2650 new seats, 2000 new seats in private uh, colleges and deemed we have 300 new seats. Now these are the new approved seats in new medical colleges okay up till now what we have seen is these are all in new medical colleges so let's now also see what is adding up to the seats which are already existing so existing college seat increment analysis for the year 2023 andhra pradesh gayatri vidya parishad institute of healthcare it's a private institution college inception is 2016 15 50 seats have increased now they have 200 seats to offer mmu ambala again um, uh, has an increment of 50 seats so 200 new seats uh, so 50 new seats will be offered under deemed Jharkhand, uh, Nirmal Mahato Medical College, uh, 50 seats have increased. So now the total number of seats in Dhanbad will be 100. Karnataka, we have Bihar Ambedkar Medical College with 50 new seats. Now it can offer 150 seats. They had an intake of 100. ESIC Corporation Medical College Gulbarga had a, uh, 125 seats to offer earlier till 2022. Now they can offer 150 seats. Kerala also we see nice good number of seats being increased approximately 250 seats are being uh, re rewarded in different medical colleges uh, we can see KMCT Medical College Calicut uh, adding up with 100 seats so now it can offer 250 seats uh, we can see Madhya Pradesh Nitaji Subhash Chandra Bose Medical College 70 seats have been added in Jabalpur so now it can offer 250 seats, whereas earlier it was offering 180 seats. Mahatma Gandhi Mission, Navi Mumbai, uh, as we all know, it's a deemed university, one of the finest in Navi Mumbai. 50 seats have been granted. We are also hearing that MGM may come up with a new medical college in Sanpada, Navi Mumbai itself, with 100 new seats. The approval is yet to be expected for the year 2023. 
Pondicherry Venkateshwara 100 seats have been increased so now they can offer 250 seats Government Medical College Patiala Punjab 25 seats have been increased previously there were 225 now they can offer 250 seats Moving ahead with Tamil Nadu, ESIC Medical College Chennai, earlier they had an uh, intake of 125, so now they, the seat increment is by 50, so 175 seats can be offered. Telangana, again we see here, the existing seats have been also increased in uh, Pratima and RBM. Uh, respectively 150 100 seats for rbm and 50 for pratima so 400 seats are being added to existing seats also uttar pradesh subharti merit uh, it has 50 new seats uttar pradesh muzaffar nagar 50 new seats um, uttar pradesh heritage also now has uh, intake capacity of 200 rajshri bareli again has an intake capacity now of 250 seats 100 seats are newly permitted Mayo Barabanki was permitted with 100 more seats, so 250 seats being increased in UP. Uh, in Mayo Institute of Medical Sciences, Career had an increment of 50 seats, now they can offer 150. So, ICARE Institute of Medical Sciences, West Bengal, Haldia, as we know, uh, 50 seats have been increased, so now they can offer 150 seats. So, this is a very good news. Uh, the number of seats, number of new medical colleges coming up, the number of medical seats which were already there in uh, uh, private or government medical colleges are also being increased. Uh, so let's see the overall uh, number of seats which are revised or which are uh, being increased for the year 2023. So government, uh, this year we have 2,870 total number of seats, uh, which are uh, beyond 2,022 seats. Private, 3,050 seats have been added uh, and deemed only 400 seats have been added. So in comparing to 2022, total number of seats increased are 6,320. Uh, this is the last update we are giving you 6320 seats being added uh, of MBBS across India uh, may it be the new medical colleges or may it be the existing medical colleges these seats have increased across various different medical colleges uh, new or already existing and if you have liked this video kindly share like and subscribe and Kindly note down our numbers. If you have any uh, doubts related to admission uh, in MBBS across India, you can always get in touch with us on these numbers. God bless you all. Thank you for watching this video. I hope, I wish everyone a very happy and successful uh, medical careers for you. God bless you all. Thank you.